I think that does work out quite nicely here. And we'll get the DJ techies, which is fine. You can play making on tech not too far. Good snipe on the courier though. So Akashi losing out on his glove of haste is pretty big. It's a little bit of attack speed, a little bit of harassment not coming out there. Ponyo does get clipped, and there's that combination we're talking about into the vibe. And Zia will find first blood as Ponyo steps out of position. So it's just a sticky bomb onto Trample. Paulson's just going to pick up a regen for himself. So you're not going to get that for Chuen, but you don't hand it away either. Some good stacks coming out. They will block Paulson. Get the split rip as well. Disruption's there to stall, but Paulson's still set to fall. They will give that to Jokam. I'm surprised that Akashi's allowed in this solo lane for quite some time. Like, they could land the blast off. Did he manage to get the strength morph? No. Doesn't find it still and will get blown up. Good coordination coming out from Bleed, and that's exactly what they need. Punish that Morphling for being solo. Down bot, they're going to try to punch Life Sealer. Great spear back. Disruption will save. There's going to be a value point in that rage, and Jack is going to run off, but not fast enough. Pass one for pass one trade. Can't really find anything. They might be able to find Jackie. People coming through the gate. Paulson is there to intercept. They do spot. Shadow Poison does not connect. Ah, they got the initial stun, but no follow up onto Jackie. Rage popped out early. WS now stuck in the middle of nowhere. Will TP away. Meanwhile, the blast off does connect. And everyone's on top of this Mars. They will pin him down. Strange move from Talon. Lead. Getting aggressive top. They spot Akashi. He does manage to get the strength morph off. Can he bail? No, he's melting to the fire. Trying to TP away. Not going to get out in time. That's the big target they need here on lead. 5 to 3 now. Finding the punish. And Talon. Still looking to build up. Still needing these BK flank they're looking for. Amplify damage popped by Chuen. Smoke on smoke. Emo caught out. BKB instantly out. But Emo, is he, he does survive through. That durability with a BKB. And that magic res he has. Chuen just melts with the amp damage. Managed to find more catching out Jokam. No save coming out from there and WS can't even play with the arena. And this is going to be the free Roshan that they're looking for. Like the Halberd, the, B, the, uh, the Ags can be massive down the line, but not necessary at this current power spike still. Maybe they find DJ, Earth Spike out. Should be able to find a nice simple techies kill. Finally, a finger kill for Jokam building into that level 15 talent for a little, little bit more HP. TP's coming in from bleed. QN is really far forward here. Stuck in the middle. Could get blasted off. Does not pop the BKB. Pops it now, but is set to fall. Just like that. TP's out. Ponyo trying to bail. Will be able to go. But that's a BKB of QN. Just the coins going off. I mean, seriously, Techies is such a massive nuisance. Bot 2 2 gone. No contest. Talon just farming up. They got the phylactery up and Akashi. Still Radiant's not enough to really feel confident here. Blink up on Zeal. You should be able to find his top tier one. And, you know, maybe they find Zeal if they time this. They will time it perfectly. Finger does come out. Emo now looking for the angle in. WS going to be the lone sacrifice. Well, BKB. They do drop Paulson. Jackie does pop his own BKB as well. Standing four. WS will fall. Trying to bail out Akashi now. Infest to save Emo, but the damage Akashi just can't deal enough. A lose tree. Three for two, Akashi. Gonna TP away. Is gonna be able to bail out. All things considered, you still gain gold there for Talon. Like it's bad. Oh my god. Oh, poor Akashi. Ah, Seal does find WS. Spear does not connect. And they'll bail out. Just a little bit of a skirmish. Poking back and forth. Down mid, Chuen will find himself a nice illusion rune. They do manage to get the hex out onto Emo. Can they get the chainstun? Can they get the damage? Finger comes in as well. They actually managed to kill the Husker. That's without the natural order coming in from that spirit. But the damage is still there. Emo playing tag. WS will fall down bot. Ponyo will be able to TP away. Overall, a win for Talon. It's much more gold leading in there. WS, of course. Lido in the rear. Jackie taking point. Joe Camp instantly managing to find that. Instantly raging. Going out. Disruption to save, though. Akashi went in with that rage. He's stuck in the middle. 
Strat morphing as best as he can, but not enough to bail out. It looks like no waveform. This man should get out. He will catch Chu Wen with a pulverize. Chu Wen will fall. Can Akashi make it? It's a lot of shadow poison stacks on him. Not enough to kill him off. Chu Wen does fall. Tell him. Cut their losses now. Joe Cam, good four staff away. Still has the blink dagger ready. They don't have their own saves here. Whoever emo jumps, no Lincolns. It's just going to be free food for him. They will kill off Zeal. All well, of that happens on the mid. And it is. You get the Spirit, instant TP's coming in, and Talon are not going to commit. Instead, they cancel TP. They're going to go for that push top. Talon's the one forced to respond to this. Emo. Again, there's two lives on this Husker. He's got the Ags. Instant Spear away. Disruption save is there. Akashi, stuck in the middle, gets taunted up. Akashi, can he save himself? Does not look like he can. Infest Bomb from Jackie cleans up. There's no counterplay here. Emo still a minute and a half in that Aegis. Sight of Vice for WS. Feels like just having all these sights, it's going to be massive. A Hex and WS. Oh, charge forward. They're going to want to jump Joe Camp, take away that instant control, and they will find it. Let's drop it down to 16 mat, 5 magic res, so. That does work to soften up the Husker. We'll find WS. Does Ogre Seal. Oh, does get four staff back. WS is gone. Talon wants to lose one set of racks. Oh, she went. Coming in, does get a good Earth Spike. Uh, split Earth, and the Earth Spike as well. Can they keep this chain control onto Emo? Again, Aegis is still there. Finger does not do anything. They've got Akashi caught out, and this could be the end. Talon, they've got buybacks, but this looks like it's all over as Bleed. Just take complete control. This Husker last pick paying off dividends. Buybacks forced out. Bleed's 2,000 gold away. All these timings are kind of thrown Radiant's off. Bottom tower is under attack. She went. His bloodstone still weighs off as well. Oh my god, she went. Don't run off. into all the mines. Back Luster without that split earth. Oh, charge forward. Zeal does get hexed up. Can they find one? No, the taunt is out onto WS before the arena can fly in. WS trying to BKB and Ogre Seal away, but he is still gone. Does manage to get the arena. This is the end. Talon, get wiped out, looks like. Akashi still alive for now. Does manage to get open wounds out. Was healing a lot, but not quite enough. Waveform away. Do manage to taunt in. Oh, Emo, he's in the fountain. Emo. That is, that's Emo without buyback. That's worth 1.3k gold for sure, but I'm not quite there yet. Talon, smoke out. DJ shows himself. Earth Spike out, Hex out as well. Disruption to save Jackie coming in to back them up. Here comes Zeal, stomping through, Joe Cam gone. Pulverized through the BKB, Chu Wen dies back. And Akachi in the middle of this entire mess is gonna try to waveform TP out. Can he make it? He will. No Chu Wen for 90. This does not look like a fight. This is why, man, playing into Shadow Demon just sucks. This hero just feels awful to play against. Panyo gets chased down by Zeal. Zeal no cares. Cuts the disruption. They will find that Elder Titan. Does have buyback. To fall. Chu Wen still 30 seconds from the respawn. Three on five scenario. Smoke from WS spotted out by these stupid ass mines again. Pulverize out the arena does nothing and WS is gone. There is nothing to do here. Akashi in the back trying to man fight but... It does nothing. No buybacks, and that's the GG. Talon get wiped, demolished by Bleed. Great showing from Bleed here in game number one. 32k lead, 27 to 9. And Talon just looked as miserable as they did in game one. Arena as well, going for like 4 4 0 was kind of crazy, but kind of makes sense. And Bleed do come out on top, so very well played again. Maybe assuming Jackie Razor. Ten. Rather interesting draft, and Chu Wen will find the first one. Scan does spot out the bot movement as well. No luck for Emo. They will manage to pick up all the bounties. They will find Paulson. This should be first blood. Fairly late. That will go to Chu Wen. They see the stacks as well. Do you believe? They should have seen the stacks. 
Typical build, max out Dark Pack, just trying to scale. Jackie is going to fall from this dive in from Talon. Ponyo with a rotation to the top. Dream Coil does connect onto Jokam. So they will find the Tusk, but probably not finding anything else here. DJ all out of mana is going up. And just goes for the push again. Fortify was already expended. There's a glimpse out, but it's just really wasting some time here. Jokam comes in, gets the shards. They should be able to find Paulson. Kinetic field to stall, but Chuen finds another. Three kills for Town to the one of Bleed. And a couple of Lotus and will back off, I'm assuming. Even not expecting to sneak around on the gate. Akashi and a load of trouble all by himself. Maybe plays against Paulson. No, it does manage to jump away. Does pop the Dark Pack as well. But is stuck in the middle. There's not much Akashi can do here. Has some stick charges. Eats the Lotus as well. He's buying a lot of time. That's four heroes onto him. But he can't really do much with that time. Kill for bleed. He'll go for the siege play. Zeal does have the split now. And that kill Nakashi. And here comes Jackie right in the middle. They do manage to get the stun. They get the they get the chain control. Jackie will go. Great save with a snowball away from Jokam. She went still alive for now, but the glimpse back will take care of that Lesh. The fine Zeal melt through the pandas. Two for one for Talon of that. But that's some good plays coming out from Talon. That was a sick, sick arena. Really nice save from Jokam. Going to be able to find Paulson as well. Wants to hand the kill over. We'll hand it to WS. What a good support from Jokam. Truly supporting his scores, giving them the food they so desire just yet. Might be able to jump Emo. And this puck is a harder target, but he did just use the orb. He did just use the orb. They do match of what? Huh? Okay, they still catch him. What? Yeah. You can... The spear flies in and you can still dodge? Ah, right. Now that is the kill they want. Go for the siege. Amplify damage onto the siege. A lot of output from Chu Wen onto that edict. Should be able to find it, no problem. Spirit vessel out. Zeal, not respecting the chain stunts, just gets bursted. We'll find a tower as well. DJ trying to stall, but not really able to do much. Witchblade, is it Witchblade or Witch? Yeah, Witchblade. Why did they think Witch Knife? Witchblade and Blink on the puck. Blink forward. WS does manage to catch up. Paulson and the glimpse now just saves so WS. Thank you, sir. Says it's really tempo setting. It has some scale. Joke. Yeah. Does get caught. Breaks the smoke. Is swapped away. On you with the save. The sharpshooter does connect. Joe Cam still set to fall. Does get the snowball away. Emo, pinged down by the spear. Not enough to fully lock him in. They do trap in WS. They will get off the Static Storm. WS is going to be able to make it out. Does look like he's glimpsed back. Zeal is out of the form, but the punch into the air with the spear. They clean up and Talon take everything away from Bleed. 12 to 2. 6k lead. Emo looking for this pick off on the bench. Akashi going forward. Does not manage to connect with the pounce. Will dodge out with a, with a Shadow Dance early on. Arena out. Can they chain stun Zeal? Oh! Gets deleted! Doesn't get the split. Doesn't have split anyway. Chuen though. Saved by a great snowball out. Will be glimpsed back in the middle of the static storm. Chuen will fall. But Akashi does have the room to find Emo. And will Jackie gone as well. Keeping the chase going. Looking for DJ Spear back. WS is he going to find it? They should be able to. It's Sharpshooter out though. And the save with a kinetic field. DJ will skitter away. Oh. WS. Glimpse not quite enough. They will find the kill. The save late from Jokam. Two for two. Not bad for Bleed. Massive streak on WS. Shield rune for Akashi. Could look for the turnaround here. That's 1,600 HP. Paulton is a juicy target. Does get the inhibit off and the Orchid Silence as well. And they'll find another. Akashi, seven permanent Agi stacks up now. As long as Emo has his spells, he's going to be able to escape. Clearing out camps, going for the next camp. Should be able to spot that. Joe Camp. It's a very small window. One second. They do manage to find it. Catching out Emo and he's deleted. Patience does pay off. They do isolate Akashi though. He's all by his lonesome here. Did pop Shadow Dance. Is going to back off. It's still... Ags for Akashi. Still about two parts away in terms of gold. They don't manage to clip Paulson. 
We could get the silence off, and Akashi just wants one a nice simple kill. We'll find it, no problem. Static Storm taken away from the equation. Pulled away from the Ags for Akashi. Finds a couple of kills here. That's going to be the full Ags up. Pounce is ready to go. They are going for the Tormentor. This is an awkward time. Talon coming in. The big arena from WS. Traps three. Finds two. Zeal still gets the split. Only the supports to fall. And bleed. Cut their losses. Back off. Bleed. What time is we looking for? Sanjin Yasha. For Jackie. Yules to save for Emo. Yeah, that's that's going to be a big saving tool. Oh! Yules out. WS. Can he get the spear back? He will. With the spear arena. Needs to follow up. Where is it? Emo gonna go forward, does have the blink, is gonna be able to blink away. Joe Cam though, still manages to catch out the blink, punch out in the air. The spear does not connect. Or before, oh, the W, yes. He finds it. They work, they have to work hard for that, but they find it. They'll find Paulson as well. Ward up top, so if the smoke breaks while he's by the ramp, they'll be able to see it. W, yes. He's going to be able to rack. There's Smoke no breaks. WS yes, should be able to back away. And no, he goes in. He wants to kill off Paulson. This is crazy. Chu went right in the middle. Does get static linked up by Jackie. Has the BKB. Lots of damage coming in from Jackie, though. Chu Wen stuck in the middle of nowhere. Does get swapped away. Get the stuns. BKB's fading. They will find Jackie. Chu Wen still alive. Zeal trying to melt him. Zeal going to lose the last panda. And they get the control onto Emo. Does manage to hide. Snowball does connect across. Jokam gets that chain stun. It's called in Talon. Will rally in game two to force us into that game three. Middle tower's down on dire side. Bleed. A great effort. Metallon in the air during your ult. This Magnus is. Creeps will get pulled back though. And that should allow again the soaking here that Bleed wants to achieve. Now this does mean attention. you get free farm for Akashi. They will get first blood onto Paulson, and it does look like that was the toss back for mid, which Chu Wen is having a slightly better time in. Toss back, skewer up. They will entrap Paulson. We'll get the sun. We'll be annoying up here. Does have TP, but they're slowly chipping away at Paulson. It's kind of funny. Delicious just coming in, poking. Jackie pokes back. Joe Cam can't poke. They have Avalanche. Oh, yes. Are you really going all in? Oh, you have to respect. Oh, the skewer down, but it's away from the Avalanche. WS will fall, but they will get Pulse, and that's a little bit of a mistake. And that is Jackie finding a stack of permanent Agi, so not too bad. You're a happy lad. You did lose Emo solo more from Emo, but Chu Wen is playing the Razor exceptionally well. Does go for the tree 1 1 build, having that little Storm Surge. A little bit more move speed to reposition is big. They do manage to blood grenade down Paulson, the most dramatic that. And WS does go for a 1 1 true build. Then going 1 1 3 just really wants to skewer people. Which I appreciate, considering the potential for toss back as well, like this. And there they go again. Jackie under tower. Doesn't have a jump tangle. We'll find one in the end. The tree will connect. And they do miss a hit. WS needs a right click. Come on, break that salve. Not gonna be able to. There, break the salve now. Okay. Jackie is still gonna be able to find more. The damage being sustained is massive. Skewer back. Do they have the avalanche? We've got the toss up. Jackie, gone. WS will get that kill for himself. Takes a little bit of time. The investment in Skewer does pay off. Until that's massive for Bleed, considering how much EXP you want on the Venge and on the Tusk. Collapsing down bot though, a massive commitment out. You get man, you get the LSA, and that's everything thrown out onto WS. Joe Cam can't do anything but watch. Does manage to get the toss. Will be next to fall. Another set of permanent Agi coming out, perhaps for Jackie or not. Does have the ult to sustain this dive. Joe Cam, one right click off, trying to juke, not going to be able to juke too far. Here comes Chu Wen. Paulson going to be sacrificed. Emo already gone. A two for two. They're gonna get the bottle refill as well for Chuen from WS. Chuen fully topped up once more. No, oh, maybe now a DJ. No, that's a lot of heroes down bot. That's everyone from Bleed. Get the arena onto Akashi. Akashi in the wrong spot. A bit 
surprising. I thought he was to his blink on the Mars. We'll try to siege Ponyo. Gonna be fine. He does have that little decrep. Should still fall, but here comes the skewer back. They managed to find Jackie to get the RP off as well. Shadow Dance is forced out, but the Avalanche is just being pinned. Ponyo makes the sacrifice and they find the bigger kill. A good exchange for Talon in the end. Ponyo spotted out by the ward. She win. Dodges out that LSA. Does get all the damage out from Emo, but he's all by himself here. Pretty far forward. The save coming in. Two win. He crept up with a life drain. Not enough. And will fall with a swap. Paulson cleans that one up nicely. Ponyo now stuck in the middle. Not able to escape. And they should be able to find Joe Cam as well. WS hanging in there. RP and 14 wants to wait a little bit longer. We'll just make the sacrifices. But they need to take a fight into Roshan. They're lining up bot. Spot DJ. Get the avalanche off, but they don't manage to... They get the toss back as well, but DJ does manage to snowball away. And Joe Cam, the attempt falls flat. But they're lost. Can find anything. Ponyo would be a very easy target to pin down. They will get the spear off as well. Ponyo should fall. And he will. Another stack coming out there for Jackie. Nine st but the BKB feels necessary. Dyer's lost their bottom tower. Still only a tier one to fall. Down mid though. Great movement out from WS. RP does connect. They find Emo. Arena though from Zeal trying to save the day. Pulls back, holds back Akashi and WS. Here comes Jackie. Has the Orchid onto WS. They've got the damage for that. They do a toss back though onto Akashi. He still has that ultimate. The swap there to try to find that kill, but DJ will still fall. Paulson next to go. Three for one. And Talon. I think relieves a lot of that pressure in this game here. Collapsing onto Ponyo. Nice simple kill. And that Pugna just gets crushed like a bug. Zeal, pretty far forward here. Chew in. Wants to find that. Zeal, still pretty far forward here. Gets into rooted. There's the Yules, and Zeal is going to be tossed up and gone. So you find the. Chasing for more WS. Does manage to get the skewer out, and they will burn down Paulson while he tries to TP home. An inching closer towards that DKB. Chu Wen gonna be very pleased with himself with that. Going for the Hurricane Pike. Radiance lost their top tower. Top tower is just gone. Tier one. Trying to find more. Dyer's bottom tower. Talon just gonna attack. go for the tier two. The defense is mounting though. Radiance top tower is under attack. Oh, Joe Cam just jumps in. Skewer back. They caught Jackie. They've still got the RP waiting. Jackie trying to run. He's gonna be able to escape. They will find Joe Cam. Akashi still alive. Does manage to pop the ultimate and will melt Emo. Aegis still stands. BKB was pop. Akashi gonna be able to just walk backwards though and start that siege. Tree, which is pretty nice. The shockwave. Just a little bit more presence. There's the BKB coming out now for WS. And he still has RP. They do manage to catch Akashi though. Aegis will fall. Can they take the follow up fight town? Arena does drop. 2N still has the BKB, but here comes Jackie finding the back line. Ponyo, not in the safe spot, will fall. Jackie still wanting to force this fight. And it will pin Akashi down. Akashi, he has nothing. RP does connect only onto the one. Snowballs the save from DJ. All dropping low on Talon, but they're dropping low as well on Bleed. The swap is there from Paulson to save. Chuen does get Laguna down. Double yes. Looking for the skewer kill. We'll find one. Jokam stuck in the middle. Avalanche toss. Does manage to find Zeal. But we'll sacrifice for this. Two for three. Two for four if you want to count. The Have to be patient into that Roshan. They've got RP ready. Double yes needs to find a big one. Could find an angle here. Clump together. Emo. Jumping onto Chu Wen. They'll find that Razor. Chu Wen. Taking point. Zeal with a blink forward. Isolates WS. Joe Cam cut off with the shards. Here though. The skewer back onto Zeal. They'll be able to trade. The swap saves from Paulson. And now Talon in the middle of a very bad fight. WS BKB TP out. Shashi forced to run away. And they'll find Ponyo as well. Three for nothing. Bleed. He's gonna go down bot. Talon gets a good read here. 
Kill cam. They spot Emo. They get the skewer back. Emo tossed in the air, and that's the sacrifice. Roshan still 30 seconds away. No buyback for Emo to join in if the Rosh fight breaks out in the next minute. The next half minute. Bleed. Again, with these Lincolns, maybe that kickback isn't going to be as big now. Get the spear back. Akashi being held in. Does have the ultimate if need be. Is gonna have to pop it. No, the first life is gone. RP is massive from WS onto everyone to skew her back out of the depth shroud as well. And they will isolate. Jackie still has that second usage of all of his spells. Does get the one shadow dance off. They will lose DJ. Paulson's gone now. Akashi still has the ult, still has the BKB. Onto the high ground. Fortify does come in with a creep wave. We'll be again stalling for time. Respawns aren't too far off. Paulson will have that swap ready. And he's back up. Jackie coming in. Trying to find one. Shadow Dance is there. Four Staff is there to save. They get the skewer back onto Zeal. Stuck in the middle. No BKB. Does drop with the gem. Toss out. Paulson's gone once more. They might be able to find Joe Cam, but the Yules is there to save. And let's start ripping onto the high ground. Buy back out on Ponyo. Uh, on Paulson. Akashi. Still safe with the ultimate, but they'll show... A little bit with the dark pack. Jumping forward. Joe Camp. Four staffs. Four staffs to save. Still has the Yules. Jackie wants this. Oh! Yules out. Joe Camp does not want to die with the gem, but might be forced to. Will fall. So that's a gem coming out now. Got his team backing him up. WS. Again. Pressure is on the Magnus to find that entrance for the team. WS smoke broken DJ in a good spot. Blink forward. They could find Emo. Is dancing around. Does manage to grab Emo. The arena only traps Chu Wen. Meanwhile, Emo dragged all the way back. Refresh on Chu Wen. Trying to get the static storm to swap there. Safe. But the toss back from Joe Cam onto Emo. Lena left alone. Lena gone. And they're still trying to find elsewhere. Chu Wen not taking any damage from Jackie with a static link. And a fight for bleed. It looked like a good smoke break. But they shouldn't be smoking anyhow. No. We're gonna have to repair lanes. Refresh for Akashi as well. Two uses of the ultimate. Two uses of BKBs. React to set fall. WS being cheeky with a blink. They will find DJ. Snowball to save. Now Yule's catching him out. Snowball to save now. Does get the kick back. All the way back onto Joe Cam. But DJ's gone. Buy back in DJ. Trying to find Joe Cam. Decrep plus Link Lotus does save. Skewer back. We'll find Paulson. And that's a dead Paulson. Still in a dieback time. Off the back of some sick plays. Oh, RP. Only catching one, but it's the big one. Jackie gone. Does have the buyback. Arena out from Zeal, but just melts in, in it. Jackie trying to fight against the world. Has the Depth Shroud pop, but not doing any damage. Where's the output? What's he supposed to do up against this mess? Shadow Dance is up. They might be able to blow up Joe Cam, but he is saved once more by the Decrep. That's all they have. WS hunting for more. Skewer back lands on Jackie instead of Emo. And Jackie is gone. Bleed. The GG is called. And Talon will be the first upper bracket finalist for PGL Wallachia Season 1 on the Southeast Asian Qualifiers a little bit shaky. Game 3 looked very even.